welcome back to another video for today's video as you can see I am going to be doing a clean and decorate with me video it has been a while since I've done a cleaning video I know not everyone is into them but I still want to make sure that I give some of you guys that do like the cleaning motivation videos some content so I decided to do a video for you guys and today we'll be decorating for Christmas we absolutely love Christmas in our home so we like to just enjoy our Christmas decorations a little bit longer so we do start decorating around November so I am going to start decorating the boys bathroom and then also my oldest son Alex's bedroom I don't normally do this I usually just do like the front of the house and then like the living room and then a few touches here and there but he's getting a little bit older and I want him to remember these things as you know he grows up so I don't know I've been really big on memories lately so I just really want to make sure that he enjoys Christmas time as much as I do and he really does so that's good and speaking of memories I started off this morning by making him some banana pancakes and you guys know that we've made it a tradition in my family well if you didn't know now you know we've made it a tradition in our family to start eating banana pancakes every weekend I'm so excited for this video this video is a collaboration with Anna or Midwest mom on YouTube she is the mom of four she has a 10 year old a 5 year old and twins so she is really busy because not only is she a mom she's going to school full-time about to start nursing school and her husband is also deployed so my heart goes out to her I absolutely love her channel she posts cleaning motivation decorating vlog style content and she's hilarious she keeps it real and she makes me laugh so make sure that you guys go and follow her channel she's really really sweet you will absolutely love her content and she is just gorgeous too so make sure you go and follow her let her know I sent you she's also going to be decorating part of her house and if you guys are coming over from Anna's channel hi my name is Allie I am a flight attendant I am the mommy of two little boys a seven-year-old a 16 month old and then I am pregnant with our third baby boy I am due in January and here you can find a little bit of everything so you will see me showing you how I balance motherhood and the flight attendant life and I'm actually going on maternity leave pretty soon so you can expect plenty of motherhood content and just like home related content which I'm really excited to make and I hope you guys come on over and subscribe I will also be doing 12 days of Christmas this year so I won't be doing vlogmas I'll be doing 12 days of Christmas and I have something very special planned for those days so make sure that you guys subscribe and have your notification bells on one thing I have in common with Anna is that my husband also served in the military he was in the Marine Corps he's no longer in but I can definitely relate to Anna and I absolutely give her props for what she's doing. I admire her a lot for holding down the fort and going to school all at the same time while her husband is gone. So if you follow me on Instagram, you guys probably know that we have been sick for a little over two weeks. I don't know what we came down with but we were all sick we had some upper respiratory thing going on so I was really behind on the deep cleaning at home so this was definitely needed so I had to scrub down the toilets and the showers and everything my husband did help me out with the toilets the night before just because for some reason during pregnancy I just cannot clean the toilets so he was sweet enough to help me with that the night before so I didn't have to do that today <laughs> and i am just using natural products when it comes to the boys bathtub just because my youngest well my soon to be middle child luca he is very sensitive he has very very sensitive skin so i have to be careful with what i use and so i like to use this little stick from clorox i believe i've used this for about two years not this same one i've replaced it but um i like to use that because it's just a lot easier for my back to be able to reach and scrub and clean and for the harder to reach areas I like to use this little scrubbing pad so that I can really get into the corners and then I just go in and just wash everything off with the little shower hose So earlier 
earlier in the video I told you guys that I like to decorate a little bit earlier and I like to enjoy my Christmas decorations a little bit longer. So we don't really put up our Christmas tree until after Thanksgiving. And then we don't decorate the outside of our house until after Thanksgiving also. But I do like to start decorating little by little. So as you can see, I'm doing the bathroom and then the boys' bathroom. And then I'm going to start working on the entry table, then the living room little by little. I remember when we used to spend Thanksgiving at my sister's house down in San Diego. We always had some sort of Christmas decoration already up. So for some reason, Thanksgiving and Christmas have always kind of mixed together for us. And then it was just like a tradition that the next day we would put up the tree. So that is just something that I grew up with. And I'm curious to know, how do you guys decorate for Christmas? Do you do it the day after Thanksgiving? Do you do it before Thanksgiving? Do you do it during December? How do you guys do it? I find family traditions and Christmas traditions so interesting. So I would definitely like to hear all about yours. And also, as I mentioned earlier, I had never really decorated my son's bathroom for Christmas. And I found this little set on Target.com and it brought the shower curtain, it brought a bath mat and two towels. And I think I only paid like $18.99 for it or something like that. I know it's still on sale, so I will link it in the description box below. I'm not sure if it's still for on sale for that price but i'll definitely link it and i'll try to link anything that i can find a link to in case you guys are interested so then i moved on to cleaning the mirrors the mirror gets so dirty so fast because my son when he's in the bathroom i don't know what he does but he just goes crazy so i'm constantly having to clean the mirror and i'm also teaching him how to clean up after himself and stuff like that so i'm just wiping down the counter with some spray and then also using an e-cloth i love e-cloths i discovered them maybe about a year and a half ago and i really really like them so i always seem to pick up one when i order uh, online and then i'm using this electric brush and i'm just trying to get into anything that i can't really reach with a little towel i got mine at target and I just like browsing the cleaning section. Do you guys like to do that too? Or am I alone in this? But I absolutely love going through the cleaning section and just trying to see the tools and all the little gadgets that I can use to keep my house clean. As you can see, I'm also wearing one of my little earphones and I'm only wearing one because kids, <laughs> but I always like to listen to something when I'm cleaning, whether it's a crime podcast, an audiobook, YouTube video. Sometimes I even have cleaning videos on and just the music that some of the cleaning videos play just kind of motivates me. What do you guys like to listen to when you guys are cleaning? So I went to Bath and Body Works and picked up some of the holiday scents and I ended up going with Winter Candy Apple and so that is what I put in that little snowman which is also a, a night light so it's perfect for my son. He's going through a phase where he's scared of the dark so he just feels better with having that in the bathroom in case he has to wake up in the middle of the night to use the bathroom. And then I also put up this garland that I found at Target and my son's favorite color is red so that is why i decided to go with the just traditional red and green christmas colors so to clean the floor in the bathroom i just like to use the swiffer dusters just because i don't like to use a broom or the vacuum that i use for the whole house and this just seems to pick up a lot and i also have this mop that I got at Target, which is amazing. It scrubs the floors and it does a really, really good job. However, I do have separate pads for the bathrooms only. I don't like to use the same ones that I use for the rest of the house. So yeah, I def definitely recommend that. It does scrub the floors really good. And you know, it's just something that I like to use every once in a while to kind of do like a deeper cleaning. And so that is it for the bathroom. I ended up just going with the traditional colors. Like I said, my son loved it. He was so happy. He loves Christmas just like me. And he was happy to see that everything was in his favorite color. Moving on to his bedroom. So I'm just starting off by removing all the sheets 
and I'm gonna go ahead and put them in the washer so that by the time the holidays are over I'm able to just replace them and put them back on and I picked up this throw blanket and the sheets from Target they were on sale so I had to pick them up because I just thought it would be a good idea for me to start doing this every year and let me tell you he was so so happy you guys will see a clip in a minute of how happy he was when he saw his Christmas sheets so I washed them the day before which is when I got them so that they would be ready for me to make the video so yeah I'm just putting them in the washer really quickly One thing about these sheets though is that they are flannel so they can be a little bit warm however it does get a little bit cold here in North Texas. We live in North Texas so temperatures do drop to 20 sometimes 18 30s so coming from California that is pretty cold to us and it does get windy so that doesn't really help with the temperature so um, my son will definitely be warm and he gets cold easily and he likes to be warm so hopefully it won't be a problem for him and then also his his bed is a size queen and it's really hard to find kid friendly sheets in that size so yeah these are the pillows that I saw at Target I almost picked one of those up but he has a cars sheet set and it also comes with a red pillow so I just turned it over so that it would match but yeah he was I'm, I'm telling you guys you guys will see how happy he is in a minute when he saw his sheets I also made sure I put back his stuffed animals just the way he likes it. He makes his bed every single day and I let him do it however he wants. So this isn't how it's going to normally look. I don't care how he does his bed as long as he does it and he knows it's part of his responsibilities. But I know his stuffed animals always have to be on his bed. So you guys can see here how happy he was and this is honestly why I do this and it's so crazy how making your kids happy can just make you so happy as a parent. So he's pretending to make a snow angel there. So I moved on to cleaning the rest of his room and just using this spray from End Dust. It was actually my first time trying it. I picked it up at my grocery store and I liked it. I actually really liked it. I see a lot of cleaning videos talk about it and I wanted to try it. And then I also got him a tree. He's always had a tree in his room but the one that he's always had broke so we had to replace it and this time I was just you know really into decorating so I asked him if he wanted to add a skirt and ornaments and he said yes so of course it had to be red and I just let him pretty much do his thing and we put up the ornaments together I will probably go back to Target and pick up a tree topper because I saw that they had some for the mini trees and they're really inexpensive I think they're like three to five dollars so it makes them happy so I'll definitely go and check out the holiday section at Target again and then just for the other side of his nightstand I uh, was cleaning the table in that picture of him that I think it was from kindergarten it cracks me up every time because he's his face is hilarious and then I just added this little Thing that I think I think I got it from the dollar spot last year and that stocking that you guys see he's had since he was a baby so we make sure to always add it to his room or a part of our Christmas decorations just as a memory and then I just added this little banner that I picked up from the dollar section at Target last year and then I just made sure that it looked even as well but that is it for this clean and decorate with me video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I was able to give you some sort of motivation on this Sunday morning. And I hope that you guys are having a great weekend. Make sure you guys go over to Anna's channel. And then also I have tons of content coming up. We're going on vacation and I'm going to have a lot of content and videos for you guys. So make sure you guys look out for those. And also come back for 12 days of Christmas starting December 1st. I'll see you guys over in my next video. Bye guys.